If you were teleported to a different era millions of years ago, just when humans didn't inhabit the earth, carrying only basic things like clothes, medicine, food, would you know which is the worst period to visit? The answer isn't simple. Between killer climates, oxygen scarcity, and gigantic creatures ready to kill, like dinosaurs, the choice doesn't seem to be pleasant at all. However, if you stick around for this one, you'll be a little more grateful for the times you live in, and you'll learn about some creepy eras you wouldn't even want to visit. Number 5. We start with a period that, compared to the next ones, is almost like going on vacation to the beach. This is undoubtedly one of the best stages for time travel and we would only have to transport ourselves 541 million years into the past to land in the Cambrian period. One of the greatest advantages of living at this time on Earth is that oxygen has just formed in sufficient quantities for humans to breathe. For that reason, you can enjoy clean air. That's where all the advantages end. You'd immediately discover that one of the biggest problems of living in this period is that there is practically no food at all. There are no plants, no land animals, and in general, life is only found in the seas. But that does not offer much consolation, quite the contrary. Going to the sea would offer you food, no doubt. There are abundant species there that are beginning to develop. Unfortunately, since there is no wood or any other object that can be used as a harpoon, catching these creatures would be extremely difficult. In addition, in case you succeeded, you wouldn't be able to cook them either and you would have to eat them completely raw. Of course, these don't sound like major evils. Raw food, lack of tools and resources to perform common human activities, doesn't sound that bad at all. At least, not compared to the next period you're about to meet. Number 4. During this period, things start to change and become much more dangerous. To get there, you have to travel 320 million years into the past and, unlike the Cambrian, the least of your worries would be the lack of food. Of course, we are in the Carboniferous period and everything is different. In this stage of the Earth's history, trees spread like giants, as did vegetation, moss, ferns, and plants. Food abounds everywhere, but so do dangers. The growth of the forests gave birth to gigantic insects and arachnids. The variety of species is frightening. From 2-meter-long poisonous centipedes, 1-meter-long scorpions, and dragonflies the size of a seagull, not to mention other examples. These creatures dominated the land and if humans had existed by then, their living conditions would have been very difficult indeed as these beasts wouldn't hesitate for a second to attack. However, the greatest danger came from the sea. For there, the amphibians had also developed at an alarming rate. Generally, some of the species emerged onto land. Many had the form of a prehistoric crocodile that was nearly 20 feet long, with thick, scaly skin and deadly teeth that wouldn't have hesitated to annihilate human flesh. Undoubtedly, this stage of life is already starting to become much more adverse. But it is still a survival challenge, a surmountable test for the right person, something that cannot be said of the next period on the list. Number 3. The next period could be the protagonist of a survival movie in which the human being opposes his environment. It's known as one of Earth's greatest extinction periods and occurred in the early Triassic when life underwent a sudden change due to the decline of forests and oxygen. Numerous species became extinct at this stage and if humans had inhabited the Earth at this time, they would probably have disappeared. The only way to survive was to inhabit the deepest valleys of the planet and stay hidden there for tens of years, although it's most likely that even here it wouldn't have been possible to withstand the harsh conditions of this stage. During this period, atmospheric oxygen declined to 10% at sea level and life became unsustainable. For comparison, at present, oxygen is between 20 to 21%, which is the percentage necessary for life to proliferate, but at that time, conditions were unbearable. 
For this reason, the floor of the planet was rapidly consumed. The fauna was disappearing and every place on the planet became a real struggle for survival that the human being would probably not have been able to overcome. Although if we are talking about titanic struggles, what follows is undoubtedly one of the most complex and adverse stages in which the human being could have found himself. Nothing compares to this emblematic period and, undoubtedly, humanity should be grateful for not having existed in this historical time. Number 2. 200 million years in the past. Oxygen is in a perfect state. Trees stretch to the sky. Creatures are constantly evolving and survival is achieved only by the strongest. Of course, the journey has taken us to the Jurassic period, the time when Tyrannosaurus rex ruled the land, megalodons ruled the seas, and pterodactyls ruled the skies. This period lasted 56 million years and was one of the decisive stages for the consolidation of the Earth as we know it today. During this stage, the supercontinent known as Pangaea broke apart due to the movements of the tectonic plates of the Earth's crust. In this event, new continents were created, as well as new oceans, which generated new conditions for the diversification of marine and terrestrial organisms. However, not everything is good news. Surviving this stage is probably completely impossible. Almost all living species will be twice the size of humans and would have the physical conditions to tear them apart without hesitation. Of course, predators are not scarce in this period and there was no way to escape from them. Since the danger lines not only in the gigantic dinosaurs over 15 meters high nor in the Tyrannosaurus rex, the velociraptors and other carnivorous creatures, but also in creatures such as insects, birds, and even species from the sea, which were just as violent as the rest. Defending against them will be a real biblical battle, similar to that of David against Goliath. During this stage, the earth witnessed the great state of savagery. Survival implied the elimination of the other. Only the strongest remained then, to our dismay, the human being would undoubtedly not have been the winner of this contest. However, if you really want to know the most difficult period to survive in the history of the Earth, you'd better get ready to discover the worst period of life on this planet. Number 1. The following is, with total certainty, the period with the lowest chances of survival for human beings. It isn't only due to the numerous predators that prowl around, but also to the climatic conditions themselves. At this stage, the world is changing and is heading towards its destruction, and to reach it, it's only necessary to travel to the Cretaceous. In this stage, there are the last great dinosaurs, the surviving species, the strongest and fiercest beasts of the planet. But the dangers are not only among the colossal dinosaurs. During this stage, there are also big cats, monstrous crocodiles, birds of prey, and a long list of meat-eaters that will be more than happy to attack small and large camps of humans. As if this weren't enough, in case it had populated this period, while humans would spend all their strength in fighting these beasts and gathering the necessary provisions to survive, the environment itself would also do what was necessary to punish and eliminate them. This was one of the periods with the greatest natural disasters, from violent earthquakes, volcanic eruptions that lasted for years, tsunamis, and fires, surviving in the midst of these adversities will be a practically impossible task. No matter where you choose to hide, the entire planet was rejecting its inhabitants and eliminated all forms of life that had the misfortune to coincide with its catastrophes. However, none of these disasters can compare to the meteor shower that ended up extinguishing most of the species from this time. The space threat impacted our planet and completely changed the atmospheric conditions. The world became a completely different one and had it been that this time in history, mankind might have never existed. This makes the Cretaceous period one of the most difficult stages for human life. Survival is practically impossible and, without a doubt, if you were teleported to this historical time, you would be dead. Fortunately, 
We are in one of the best eras of humanity, although that doesn't mean we are exempt from dangers. Although you can't imagine it, we are surrounded by catastrophic possibilities that could end human life, and if you want to know some of them, you'd better check out the following video.